Uh, time to be enthusiastic. Salutations, gaming enthusiasts. George Maynard here. I am getting really, really tired of having four whole Let's Plays going on at once. And I'm also really, really tired of uploading every single dang week. So, I'm gonna freaking speed run to the end of Super Mario RPG and play the rest of the game in one day! I've been told I'm a bit over halfway, so I'm gonna try and get all the rest of it in. I might be a bit more low energy, a bit more low key, we'll see. I did sleep for like 10 hours last night, but I still, my eyes still hurt for some reason, and I still feel kind of sleepy, oh well, oh well, whatever. The power of strong coffees will get me through this. Let's hope that I have fun with the rest of this game. Gonna be real with you though, I kinda hate playing new games for Let's Plays. It just kind of slurps all the fun out of it to be honest because like I'm like oh, I'm playing this game to entertain people and I'm not just playing it to have fun. We wouldn't want to let an old tradition die would we as we have with uh, Born of Bread and the Plucky Squire before let's start an episode of Super Mario RPG by playing a bit of the game I had running before I started recording. Ha ha ha. Here is Super Mario Party Jamboree. It's been pretty fun so far. I'm doing some of the single player at the moment. It's a fun single player mode. It, it doesn't seem to take much time but it's really, it's pleasant and nice. It's it's nice that they also, I like how they also brought back bosses for the single player from, from Mario Party 9 and whatnot. I can tell by the enlightened sparkle in your eyes that you hit all four Koopa Trooper Stamp Rally Stations. Oh no, they brought this minigame back. Oh no, I think I have played this game, this minigame in this game before. Oh my goodness. Fine. I don't like this one, this one sucks. Someone just follows you and invalidates all of your work. Go away, Toad, go away, Toad, go away, Toad, go away, go away, Toadette, go away, go away, go, leave my pink blob alone, leave it alone, go away, stop, infect, stop it, get away from my pink blob, everyone, why, leave, go away, leave me be, stop it, Toad, die, die, mushroom, Waluigi, keep to yourself, stay over there, stop. I came third. I hate this mini game. <laughs> Why is this come back like three times or something? I don't want to ever play this mini game again, but I want to get all the mini stars. Okay, different strat. Just go all over the place. It's stupid, but like someone's inevitably gonna follow you and go over your stuff. And it's really hard to like actually keep the progress that you make because they're just going all over the place. Removing all of your hard work and making you miserable. I hate everything. Did I win this time? Yes. Yeah, so a single player mode in this game is pretty neat actually. You just sort of go around the board however however you want. Just like kind of chill and you help people with like little side quests. Reet, on Super Mario RPG. I have, by the way, been playing through My Own Rabbit's Box of Hope again for the second time. I want to get through all of it and the DLC before um, Mario and Luigi Brothership comes out. We'll see if I'll be able to manage that. The DLC might take me a while longer. Right then, in it for the long haul, let's -a go! I'm tired of logging on to this game and going, ugh, the jump button is B. If I finish the game, I won't have to worry about that anymore. Let's see what all the J's stand for, shall we? Feel like I'm gonna find that out in here, what? Oh, it's another mimic, it's, it's what oh We had her what, and now it's what oh I remember her what being kinda strong, and I, no, I died to it, didn't I? You know what, I'm not gonna give it a chance, let's just do whatever this does. I didn't read the description, I should've. Why are we in the desert? <laughs> that was kind of pants, actually. Why was that so pants? Oh, I got a double slap. That's so pathetic! Ah! Uh, oh, you got a piranha plant in you. That's neat. That's neat. But the piranha plant doesn't have eyes. Where are the eyes from? Terrific. Mario is dead. Um, I don't have a, like, a res move, do I? I don't. Uh, it's a spinny, 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 yes. Sheepies. This is like sleepy sheep later on. Resistance! Great! <sighs> the one I wanted to affect is not affected. Terrific. Oh, I've got to throw my toy at him because Mario is deceased. Oh, great. Love attacks I can't block. Great. Oh, you do like nothing. 
who can attack better than Peach? Gino, let's see. I suppose it makes sense that slapping wood would not hurt it, really. Why do you have so much health? Stop being alive! Ah! Bah! I am enraged! Why is this the first bloody fight that I get into when I boot up the game? Ugh! Do I have any pick-me-ups? Yes, I have five of them, okay. I'm gonna try and set it on fire. It's made of wood, right? So, oh, that, that's very nice of the game. Did the original game do that and just give you freebies out of the blue? I don't remember. Fireball. Please be extra vulnerable to this. Please, 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 please! RESISTANCE! Things made of wood should catch fire. I'm not crazy for expecting that, am I? Fine. I'll move Bowser's rotting corpse off the battlefield and bring in this guy. Oh boy. One. Love that. Oh, you get to move twice in a turn. Love that even more. It's so fun. Stop being alive! Stop doing 130 damage! Ugh! I'm probably- I'm gonna- I'm gonna die now, aren't I? No indication- RESISTANCE! It's just resistant to everything, I guess! And all these Goombas didn't die to the bloody thunderstorm! Oh, sure, do- oh, Crying out loud. Oh, Peach just comes in automatically, that's- That's very generous. If I were designing it, I would've given them a game over for that. Oh, my goodness. I don't want to waste all my pick-me-ups on this! It's just one boss, and everybody is dead. I'm gonna, can I bloody run away? I can't run. Great, kill me, I don't care. Just give you the slap with one damage. Kill me, go on, do it, thank you. Uh, yeah, I know how RPGs work. Well, I'm not gonna bother with that again. Uh, we were out. We're off to a rip roaring start, people. Oh, starfish again. They're still looking a bit dead, despite being in water now. Still not dead, eh? Are these enemies just a lot stronger? Is there suddenly a massive difficulty spike? Eh, that's not too bad. That wasn't too bad. Ah, for Pete's sake. Oh, that was just one. Okay, getting real tired of dying in this game. Mario and Luigi just is the, like, best Mario RPG series, because you can just, like, dodge and counter-attack in really intuitive ways. And this game is just... There are 20 million attacks, each with their own different blocking timing, and you can't really see it coming, and you've got to keep an eye out for the exclamation mark, but that goes away eventually, so... You better learn them all, and remember each and every one, or you're screwed! That's, that's like just a really, really terrible system. I don't understand why they would do that. It just, it just does yoga and gets health back. Wiggle, wiggle. Oh, for Pete's sake. I get like a fraction, a tiny, tiny fraction of a second to notice the exclamation mark and react. Oh god. I can't switch Mario out. I hate everything. Zero Star's FP is gone. Alright. Is that something that it keeps track of for every enemy in the game? I don't know. You can use recovery specials in the field with Y. With Y. Um. Why? Yay, but if I'm discovering that in the menu, couldn't you let me do it in the menu as well? You can tell me that I can do it easier, but. Could you just let me do it there as well, just to be nice? I want to use the Thunderbolt from Mallow because it's like one of the only hit everyone moves I have. But I bet that the jellyfish are uh, resistant to thunder because it makes sense. They're electricity themed. This is why it would have been great if Mario's new fire move hit everybody instead of being useless. <laughs> uh, that never doesn't make me laugh, him chucking Mario. It's so funny. <laughs> I love the little hip wiggle. Uh, oh, bugger. It's, it's so little notice on the timing. Thank goodness this game is generous with stuff like that. That's nice. Cannons. Cannon to the left of them. Cannon to the right of them. Volleyed and thundered. Oh, my goodness. It is a robot crab. He's cool. I like Krusty. 
<laughs> Mr. Kipper. I, I kind of, like, uh, Deep Cheap makes more sense, like, just like, from a naming perspective, but Mr. Kipper is very whimsical, and I do like that name, it's fun. Also, what, didn't I just encounter a nanny blooper? Shouldn't that mean that one of these is a nanny blooper? Any, no, you just bloopers. Where are the babies? Make the children fight! Do it! Yes, they all happen to be weak to it, let's go! Instead of being randomly taking no damage whatsoever. <laughs> I don't, I don't have time to just stay here and beat up children all day. There is a way, there is some kind of other room underneath those barrels over there, but I guess that I can't go in that way. Can I please leave the water? Fine. It's a bit finicky, is that, weirdly enough. Oh, bunch of shark guys. Hello. Arr, what's going on here? Who are you? This is me making up for missing Talk Like a Pirate Day this year. What? You're looking for a star? I'll let you see stars. Aha! Anyway, you're out of luck. You see, whatever falls into the sea becomes Johnny's property. Got that, matey? Oh, and one last thing. Read my lips. We ain't letting you through. Got it? Oh, good. I love me some shark fin soup. No, Mario's too nice. He wouldn't condone those nasty fishing practices. Oh, goody. I love me some shark fin soup. Yeah, Bowser do it, that's fine. <laughs> Freaking shocker, that's stupid. That's just... It costs more and it's probably a fair bit stronger, but like, it's just inherently less valuable than something that can hit everybody. I don't understand why they saw that as an upgrade. If I was making this game, like, look at that! That's bloody good for only two FP. If I were making this game, I would have swapped those moves around. I would have had the single target thing available from the start and the multi-target, uh, like, unlockable later. It seems backwards. It's weird. Ah, uh, they're not dead anymore. <laughs> Arr, you're stronger than you look! Better warn the upper deck. Come on, mates! There he is, get him, boys! How many sharks do I have to fight? Here, this is on us! gonna hurt you too. Oh my goodness. They're not too pri- Are they these guys? What the- How dare you dodge the barrel! <coughs> oh. Let's give Mario more HP. He's like the one guy you can't replace, so it makes sense to keep him alive, doesn't it? This is a few people's favorite character on Twitter. By the way, I'm- I'm technically still on Twitter, but I'm like mostly just leaving it alone now because I'm- Move, I'm, I've moved to Blue Sky for the most part. It's better. The link to my Blue Sky will be in the description in case you want to follow me there. So you're THE Mario, eh? Ah ha ha! Not much to look at. Well, this star fell into my sea, so it's mine. If you want it, you'll have to fight for it. I've got me a cool trident, I have. Get ready to be skewered in three places. Yeah, Johnny's pretty cool. Uh, I mean, his his minions are sharks, but he appears to just be wearing a shark skin. Did he, like, kill their previous leader and enslave them or something? Or maybe they hated their previous leader and he liberated them. Hmm. I want to know, I want to know the history behind the shark skin. Hmm. I'm curious, I'm curious. Uh, I'm bad at this timing. Ah, uh, I got like, I guess. You get so little notice. Ah, uh, I hate, I hate blocking attacks in this game so much. Oh my goodness gracious, flipping me. Okay. Uh, well, I might as well. There you go, Mario. I mean, if I'm not going to use it for bosses, when am I going to use it? Uh, let's use Terra. Why does Bowser still only have one special move? He'd better get a fire one that hits everybody at some point, because that just makes too much sense. You're getting good and skewered now. Bonk. I'm going to break your shins. Does Bowser have, like, way more defense than everybody else? Because it, it's really looking that way. It kind of makes sense that he would get tough. Oh, ooh, he's, he's red now. Oh, my goodness. It's, I assume that he has more attack power now. This is the super good one. How much super good is it? Not that much better than the base one, to be honest, for how much more expensive it is. How about it, Mario? Mario versus me. Wanna mix it up? 
Crew look alive and cheer me on! Oh no, it's a 1v1. No, I don't want a 1v1. That's such a bad idea. Oh, I'm so mismatched. Break his knees. Oh, I am so gonna lose. Oh, the, oh. Is... <laughs> did he get weaker because it's a 1v1? I think he just got weaker. <laughs> uh, I don't have enough for a super fireball. Uh, you know, I do have enough for super jump, though. Theoretically, this could just one-shot him if I am good enough and aren't crap. I'm crap. Oh, for Pete's sake. Ah! Yeah, weirdly the, like, fire laser thing that he has is, uh, weaker than the stabbing me thing. <laughs> ah, for Pete's sake, the timing is so bull! It's so bull! Right, I need to heal. Ah, uh, do, do I have any items that can heal and restore FP at the same time? Like the candies in Mario and Luigi. They're gonna run out of mid mushrooms. I don't have anybody with healing abilities or anything. Never mind. Apparently I have infinite items. Ah, for Pete's sake! Heal, get stabbed, heal, get stabbed, heal, get stabbed. Ah, I'm so bad at the timing. Whatever, super jump again. I suck! I suck so much! Thankfully, I have infinite mushrooms, so it's it's no worry. It's just extremely tedious. Is this part of the battle just, like, rigged to uh, always give you your items for free so you get them back immediately? It might be. Very generous of the devs. Ah, yes! I... You don't suck as much as you think you do. You've earned the star. Think of it as a souvenir of our fight. There we go. Good stuff. Yippee! MacGuffin number six? I forget how many I've gotten. Uppies! This guy does. It has a really cool design, though. I wouldn't mind to see him in another game later. You must have really wanted that star. Now go on! Get out of here before I change my mind. Hello. John is our main man. He even fights in his sleep. We'd follow him anywhere. Okay, cool, cool. Oh, look. This is 100% current juice. It's mighty tasty stuff, mate. Yes, it's not wine, is it? Hmm, wink, wink. <laughs> you found the star well done. Uh, I'm stuck in pirate mode. But your journey ends here. You're so gullible, don't you know who I am? I'm Spiritovich, a member of Smithy's gang, shocked! What? I'm so confused. It's no wonder my impersonation of an ordinary person was flawless! I, uh, I am really actually stuck in the pirate accent. How do I get out of this? I'm stuck. I guess I'm a pirate for the rest of my life. And I wouldn't say that you played the Elder as a normal guy. I fully thought that you... Uh, did some really, really weird things and wanted to shove the star up your butt. Let's give, let's give this guy a really cool sounding British accent. Your search for the stars has worried Smithy. So if I take that star back to him, I'll earn brownie points. This is the way to get ahead. It's futile to try and fight me. Just hand it over nice and easy. No, actually, let's get serious. So that's how you want to play it. What do you think will happen to the real inhabitants of Seaside Town? Real Elder, that's his actual name. What are you doing? No, don't do that! No, please stop! Ack! He's dead now. Now isn't it a shame for an innocent old man to be tickled like this? <laughs> Is he tickling him? No, I'll get serious! He's just gonna go back and tickle him more! No, you wouldn't! The two of you are going to- No, please not there! I. <laughs> what if I just get, let him get tickled a million times? I don't care if he gets tickled. You're gonna have to start chopping off some limbs if you want me to give it to you. <laughs> okay, all of the. <laughs> you can't treat me this way! I can't bear this! <laughs> 
<laughs> now isn't it a shame for an innocent old man to be tickled like this? I told you, chop off some limbs and then we'll get serious. <laughs> I don't care. Oh, I just, I just need to... Uh, dot, dot, dot. Is he dead now? Did they kill him? Is he passed out from the tickling? Fine. You've got me caught in a, in a conversation. I guess... This is more deadly than any boss fight. When you are trapped in a conversation, you are in stalemate. If you can't choose to say, screw you, no. <laughs> that doesn't really match my voice I gave him, I don't care. And to think I got the star without even soiling my hands. I'm such a genius, it scares me sometimes. No wonder I'm so important. All right, everyone, listen up. We're returning the, to the castle. Our ride should be here about now. The blade's late. What's taking it so long? We need to get out of here. Oh, bugger. This is just great. Mario caught up with us. Only one thing we can do now. Although we may rust a little, we'll have to swim for it. Not so fast there. That star's a gift to me mate, Mario. You spineless dogs have no code of honor, and I don't know how to spell honor. We'll make you walk the plank. I mean, if the sharks are already on the land, I, walking the plank seems like a redundant step. Just have the sharks eat him. <laughs> Johnny, maybe we should leave Mario the pleasure of wrapping things up here. Yeah, I'd like to that. Do that. Let me let me beat this guy. <laughs> I guess it's. I guess we'll have to take our disguises off now. Group formation! Okay. Oh, they were all him? Oh, wow. He really contracted into that outfit, didn't he? He's pretty cool, and suddenly it's sunset as well. And suddenly it's a lot more rocky as well. Oh, well. Spiadovich! Or is it pronounced... Spear Dovic or something, I'm not sure. Was he did he have a different name in the original version of the game? I think he did. Oh, is he also is he a fellow mustache haver? That looks like a mustache to me. Gino beam this fool. Zap! That did 40. Water blast. Wait, he was they were afraid of getting wet and rusty, but he has the ability to summon water. He has a water-themed attack. That feels kind of backwards. This is a really pretty battlefield though. That did that did more than the Geno Beam. What the heck? I should get guaranteed more damage than my regular attack if I'm doing a special attack. That's a load of rubbish. I doubt slapping will do much. Oh for Pete's sake. It really is crazy how some attacks by like specifically Mallow and Peach just do thoroughly negligible damage and it's like comically pathetic. How does he do with electricity? I've, I've got like this this move it is good to have a single target and an everybody target for moves like this. Like in Octopath Traveler like pretty much all of the uh, different elemental attacks they have a single attacking version on some char on, on one or two of the characters that can hit one enemy stronger. <clears throat> and they have an attack everybody move, which is very good for like dealing with regular enemies and getting rid of a bunch of them at once. So they both have utility, but like for most battles in the game where it's regular enemies and there's a bunch of them at once, you want the the hit everybody moves. Oh wow, that was one bolt. Oh, this is weakness. Excellent. Ow. That I had more notice there. I'm just bad and slow. Yeah, no, Mario's normal attack is fully, does fully more damage than his Super Fireball did. I wasted so much. Some syrup. Let's get some maple syrup, sure. That did not look like maple syrup. Why was it green? Mirage attack. Oh my goodness. Ah, I should use the attack everybody Thunderbolt now. I should get past turns. Gotta hit the right one. Or use, oh no, do they both take, oh they both take damage. Do they just, like, divide his HP between him and his double? Are they both just as much him as the other? I'm curious. I mean, no, we did see him, like, split into several other different toads. So this makes sense in the lore of this character. Interesting. Interesting. He's an interesting bad guy, isn't he? He is. I like Spiernovich. 
Flamestone, I blocked it, wow. Huge Meteor, no damage. <laughs> oh yeah, I think that this lowers defense, so this is handy. Even though it's a multi-targeting thing. Oh no, he's, he's resistant to it, never mind. I'm not scared of anything. Wait, why did I do that? That was pathetic. Oh great, oh. It's gonna be a bit of a team wipe. Oh, it's a team wipe. Oh, buggeration. Um, <laughs> can I not revive party members that are not currently out? Oh my goodness, that's extremely silly. That's ridiculously silly. That's stupid. So now I just don't have access to the character who can do critical damage. Do I need to target them both or can I just work on one at a time? I'm not sure how this works exactly. Oh my goodness. Oh, <laughs> He took off his head and put it on his spear! That's awesome! Uh, I mean, he is a spear. I suppose it makes sense. That's really fun, though. There we go. Back into one. Ah, there we go. Excellent. Also nice. Oh, finally, a new move. Poison gas. Interesting. Interesting. I have a poison move now. That's good. So I assume that'll do chip damage over time. Uh, but that also sounds like it's going to hit everybody at once as well. Which is the kind of mood I move I desperately need more of, so that's always nice to see. Mm. Is Peach ever going to get, like, an attacking move? I suppose her specialty is healing, and that's fine, but, like... And it would be nice if she got a healing move that, um, actually revived people. That would be really handy, so I don't have to rely on pick-me-ups. Where'd Jonathan Jones go? He dipped. I thought he was going to stay here and watch the fight. Smithy is now in the race for the star pieces. Oh yeah, because they weren't actively trying to get them before now, were they? No, they weren't. Bowie just like found one randomly and is like, Eh, might as well take this. And the rest of them like weren't held by any of Smithy's people. And this is the first time that they've actually tried to get one. That's right, isn't it? It's weird that the main enemies of the game like, only actually start trying to get the MacGuffins that you're after more than halfway through the game. That's... that's peculiar. What horrible surprises might we ha he have in store for Mario? Alright, I got a key. Yay. Oh, is this from Jonathan? To Mario. Knowing you, it must have been a breeze knocking down Speary, eh? By the way, my pirates say they saw a huge axe flying across the sky. It's probably one of Smithy's nasty friends. Go get him, pal! Well, my gills are failing on me, so I'll be heading back down. Drop in whenever you have time, okay? Your true mate, Jonathan Johnny Jones. Awesome. So that's why he wasn't watching the fight. It was because he... So he's actually a sea creature. Is he still a shark, but just wearing the skin of a bigger shark? I'm not sure, but this music is nice and jovial. That sounds like a good place to wrap up an episode. Hope you enjoyed that, viewers. It's a fun game. I swear I'd be enjoying it even more if I was playing it on my own. I don't know. I don't know. Someday, I kind of would like to stream games. I feel like that might assuage my problem. Like, I don't have to edit it as much. I don't know. Maybe that would be better if I wanted to play new games on the channel. If I want to stream it. I don't currently have the means to do that or know how to. But maybe someday. We'll see. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed, viewers. Subscribe for more. Gonna finish off. I'm, I'm gonna continue playing and play the rest of this game today. But you gotta subscribe and wait a bit for the rest of the series. Ooh. Lovely. Lovely. Ta-ta. Play my Apothecary Jamboree. It's good.